and welcome to my channel. Today I will be talking about my angel's hamster enclosure, the stackable one. Obviously we all know they have the Nine Angel Bigger World, the Nine Angel Vista, and different sizes, but this is something a little bit different for Nine Angel and for ordering a cage that's not completely wooden. So I am excited to talk to you guys about this. If you guys would like to see my thoughts and opinions on Nine Angel Bigger or Nine Angel Vista or if you're torn between the two, then definitely click on this video up here. Not yet, because I still got to talk about this one, but definitely click on this video where I compare the two and help you hopefully decide which one is better. Because if you guys don't know or if you're new, I, I have both currently. So I've had the D-top, I've done the bins, I've done both my angel, um, uh, both my angel hamster cages I have done so I definitely have my own thoughts and opinions on them but if you like to see my comparison on that one definitely click up there and then if you wait like you should wait then it will be in the description box below so this one really had me excited when I saw it I was like wait what my angel got another hamster cage how come I haven't heard about this is it new it must be new because I'm pretty sure all they had was bigger world and then the vista and now it's this and now i'm wondering like should i get it because for those who need space this is definitely might be a winner for you i have notes because there is a lot to cover and i don't think i'm gonna have everything memorized because this video would be completely terrible if i did that okay so these are the night angel stacker series it's a stackable large um hamster enclosure and it's glass like acrylic glass the whole thing is completely see-through unlike like some of them how obviously like you have a couple pieces of wood here a couple pieces of wood there but this one's like all around you have three side glasses and then you also have the front acrylic door so obviously usually our doors are at the top for most of our hamster cages but these are more in front of you so it's more on the front instead of the top because obviously you're not the other nine angel hamster cages the lid is at the top but this one since it's stackable it's more on the front um side instead but they give the inner and the outer dimensions of this hamster cage which is something that i absolutely love that they did because some places especially like your pet stores they lie about the dimensions which there's nothing worse than that because as we all know, like in this like small animal community that the dimensions really matter. So I love the fact that they were so transparent to tell us not only the outside dimensions, but the inside dimensions as well, which means that they actually listen to us. So I'm gonna have an insert, like I'm just gonna have an insert up here of the images, well, of the dimensions so that you can easily see instead of having me to read it out and you just have to memorize what I'm saying. For the breathing, like ventilation part, it is a mesh lid at the top. And this mesh actually looks a bit more like more, a little bit more open and breathable than like your standard um, store-bought mesh. This is something that Night Angel definitely does that I've noticed in both of their enclosures is the bottoms on their enclosures are very smooth so it's not rough or anything like gritty that your hamster can actually attach their teeth to because if it is if it's not smooth that's how your hamster can really chew out is if they're able to grab like some like ugh, like some traction to the to like the wood that's how you have to able to chew out so i love the fact that night angel always kept it like super smooth throughout so that your hamster cannot chew and they did no different on this enclosure either thank god so this one also has that very smooth um, board around it just to make sure your hamster can't escape. So if you have any chewer hamsters, honestly, you will be okay um, with this enclosure. Most wooden enclosures, I would never recommend to hamsters to chew unless you take a lot of precautions. And whenever you're doing like a deep clean or even a spot clean, but to check and make sure they're not trying to escape. So you may be thinking because the opening is on the front door, it may not be very easy to clean it out or just anything like that because obviously we're used to the top so we're able to like really reach in there but it's a way to be easily cleaned 
you can they made it really easy to just remove the mesh and the beams so that you can like access it even more instead of just having to use the front door even if you need more it does have a two-door design so you do have your front and if you don't have it stacked and you want a little bit more access inside you do have that top layer which is where that mesh lid is that also can open up this hamster cage is actually not it's expensive I don't remember the prices of each of them, of the Bigger World or the Visa, but I know I paid like, I think like around 300 for the Visa, but I got it in the large. And I don't remember how much I paid for the Bigger World, but I'm gonna put the prices up here of those two. And then the price of the stackable acrylics ones right here, which is the one I'm talking about right now. So that is just 219. And I'm not sure how long they'll have this there, but if any of you like really do want to get it like now and you're looking for something, and you want it to save space or you just really like the look of the modern design then they do have a 10 percent off coupon right now so now you're probably wondering exactly how do i stack it can i just buy two and they just easily go on top no you can't um you actually have to buy the stackable accessories first if you want to stack them up so you gotta buy those separate um that is something that they do mention, but I feel like if you're not reading it enough, you probably won't know and you'll just buy two expecting to just stack them up. Don't do that. Just just definitely um, make sure you go on there and buy that. Also, this is something random, but if you want to buy wheels for your hamsters enclosure from Night Angel, they do offer wheels for that because obviously it, you have to have a seat on the ground and not everybody wants that. I don't have my seat on the ground. It's sitting on like a shelf. But if you want it on wheels, you can buy Night Angel wheels off their off Amazon. And I think on their website too, but you can get them off of Amazon. So just throwing that out there. Now we're going to talk about the dimensions. It's I'm going to do length times width times height. But as you all know, height doesn't matter too much. Well, it doesn't matter for your square footage. But it does matter to have to know that your hamster cage has height. That way when you're putting it in your bedding, you know if you can actually put a lot and you can actually like have a lot of stuff inside your hamster's enclosure. So it is 33 by 3 by 19.4 by 21.5 and this would give you a rough estimate of about 644 square inches of floor space which isn't bad considering especially where you stay but where I am in the U.S. is 450. It should be more than 450 but if you have this enclosure I actually feel like it can be really great or like beneficial for a um like a dwarf hamster maybe a chinese hamster or maybe like a robo um probably syrians i probably would, like hesitate a little bit more and i would like really up the like enrichment in their cage that way they're not getting bored since they are a bit larger but night angel is also recommending this cage for mice as well i think it's mice hamsters I think that's it. I could be wrong. Don't quote me on that part. I'm just a hamster channel. So if you want to know if it's okay for them, obviously you like take that knowledge into your own hands, like off the information that I'm giving you and off of your own knowledge and research. So um, this cage is definitely, have I inserted a picture? If I haven't inserted a picture, it's right here. That's like the most awkward way to tell you that here, here's how the cage looks. But this cage is so like modern and just clean and sleek. And I love how the whole thing is just basically open and that I can stack them up because I do plan on moving um, like really soon, like the next few weeks. So having that ability, if I ever choose to like get another hamster cage, which I probably won't. Cause I already have two. So unless I get like four hamsters, I probably won't have a stackable hamster cage. Cause then at that point, I don't need to buy one hamster. I don't need to buy this hamster cage if I don't plan on getting another. Cause then it kind of defeats the whole utilization of this hamster cage and being able to stack them up. If it makes sense, then that's what I'm thinking. But I do plan on it. So it would be like really cool to, um, be able to stack up your hamster cages and i also know that some of you guys obviously don't have like enough space or you want to up your hamster's cage and you're saying like you don't have any space where you are for like a larger cage this one is like probably like right up your alley for you 
because you can just get it, put it in the corner, and if you have more than one hamster, buy the stacking accessories and just stack the hamster cages up so it's not taking so much like space, but more that space, which obviously is like less in your space. Yeah. Those are just my thoughts and opinion on this hamster cage. I do think I will buy it possibly in the future, like a while from now, just because of how it looks. I'm not in a rush to get another hamster cage right now, that's for sure. Let me know down in the comment section below, like, have you heard of this? Have you gotten it? Are you thinking about getting it? Or if you'd rather just pass and you'd rather keep either what you have or you'd rather purchase the other night angel hamsters enclosures. And yeah, I would love to be able to hear you guys' thoughts and opinions on this cage, especially because the square footage is a bit different than most people are kind of aiming for right now. But thank you all so much for watching and I will see you all in my next video.